In this series, we have seen fairly poor attempts at the Northern Irish accent. They're gone. It is human life, what have you saving? A circus climber like. Now you're gonna blow my brains out or shoot my finger off. I'm going to heed the advice of Jack and Erin and show how Sam Neil nails the accent in the show Peaky Blinders. Our scheduled meeting is not until Sunday. If we're meeting for the first time, I'm Alistair, an English teacher and Northern Irish dialect coach. To know more about English, languages or accents, consider subscribing. Should you be an actor looking to master your Northern Irish accent, then contact me using the details in the description below. Our first clip. Yes, we had a meeting and your letter was read aloud. Listen to how Inspector Campbell says the ing sound in this word and his perfect pronunciation of this word, masterful. Yes, we had a meeting and your letter was read aloud. Both of these features are prominent in a Northern Irish accent. In versus ing. Missing versus missing. Missing versus missing. And the lack of the diphthong ow. Allowed versus allowed. Allowed versus allowed. No diphthong ow. Our second clip. And at the place that has already been determined. Here, notice the rhotic R in the pronunciation of this word. And at the place that has already been determined. This is an essential feature of the Northern Irish accent. Every R has to be said no matter where it appears in a word or in a sentence. We pronounce them all. Non-natives struggle with this one, especially when the R is at the end of a word. Before we continue with our third clip, I should add a disclaimer at this point. Unlike Brad Pitt, Sean Bean and others in this series, Sean Neal was actually born in Northern Ireland, in Oma to be precise. However, at about age six, he did move to New Zealand. In any case, his is an excellent example of the Northern Irish accent on screen. Our third clip. A major point. Good night, Mr. Shelby. Pay attention to the lack of the diphthong A in this word. A major point. Good night, Mr. Shelby. Made versus made. Made versus made. Northern Irish speakers are notorious for shortening diphthongs, and this is something you absolutely have to get to grips with if you're learning the Northern Irish accent on screen. Who else do you think nails the Northern Irish accent? Comment below. You just wanted to show me that you know where I live, isn't that it? Am I supposed to be impressed? With your Northern Irish accent? Yes, absolutely, it's cracker. Should you be an actor looking to master your Northern Irish accent, then please contact me using the details in the description below. I'd love to help you. Now to find out how not to do the Northern Irish accent, as showcased by some world famous actors, check out this playlist. Or if you'd prefer to discover 20 words that Northern Irish people say, check out this video instead.